Welcome sa sip9.com uh, In this video, pag-aaralan natin kung paano ba mag-multiply and divide ng integers. Ano? So, tingnan natin kung ano ba yung effect ng uh, positive number at negative number or sabi natin integers kasi integers naman ang pinag-aaralan natin sa multiplication at sa division. Ano? So, let's start with multiplication muna. 3 times 5. Kunwari, Sagot is 15. So, pagparehang positive, wala tayong problema. Positive yan sigurado, ano? Dahil uh, simula pa yata nung grade 1 natin ay nagmumultiply na tayo ng positive number. And we know that positive times positive is positive, ano? What about positive times negative? 3 plus... Uh, Ibahin naman natin. Huwag 3. 4 times negative 6. Ilan? 4 na negative 6. So, negative 6. Negative 6 plus negative 6 plus negative 6. Plus negative 6. Ang ilagay ko na yung negative sa taas para mas na ma-distinguish siya sa minus. Okay. So ilan? Ilang, ilan yan? Pag-aralan natin na sa addition of integers na pag, pag negative yung pina-plus mo, lahat. Pa-plus mo lang yan. And then the sign is negative. So this is negative 24. So, ang positive plus negative pala ay negative din, ano? Kasi ang mangyayari dyan, mag-a-add ka lang mga negative, ano? Okay? Oh, sorry. Para natin yung buburahin. Number three. What about baliktad naman? Unahin naman na natin yung negative. Negative times positive. Negative 3 times 2 equals. Ngayon, uh, ang multiplication, ang sabi natin, commutative, di ba? Isa so, yan sa mga properties ng multiplication at addition. Ibig sabi ng commutative, pag may number ka na, di ba? 3, 3 times uh, three times 8, kunwari. Sorry. Pag nag-multiply ka ng number, Pareho lang yan kahit balikta rin mo yung answer. I mean, kahit balikta rin mo yung number, pareho lang yung answer. Ano? 3 times 4, kumari. 4 times 3, pareho lang. Pareho lang sila ng sagot, di ba? Na 12. So, ibig sabihin, kahit balikta rin itong natin itong number na to, pareho lang din naman yung sagot. So, magiging equal to, burahin natin to. 2 times negative 3. Okay? But 2 times negative 3, pareho rin siya dito, di ba? Positive times negative, which is negative 6. Sabi mo, mag-add lang tayo ng tatlo, katulad nito, ano? Sabi sabi, negative times positive is negative. Okay? Next. Ang pinaka-last ay parehong negative. Negative 9 times negative Four. Well, dito, wala akong mabibigay na explanation dito. Memorize nyo na lang that pag negative times negative is 36. Positive siya. Negative times negative is positive. Ano yung explanation nito pattern? Kaso, uh, hindi naman natin na i-discuss yan dito. So, ang pinaka-key lang dyan ay kung sa Kung ang sign ng dalawang numbers ay parehong positive, positive. Pag parehong negative, positive. Pag magkaiba, negative. So, pag pareho yung signs, positive. Parehong negative, positive. Pareho, pareho, positive. Magkaiba, negative. Okay? So, hindi naman siguro ganun kahirap i-memorize. Ngayon, this is multiplication, ano? 
Ngayon ang maganda dito, hindi nyo na kailangan memorize yung ano, yung sa division kasi pareho lang ng pareho lang ng rules, ano? Bakit? Kasi pag halimba, pag sinabi mong 2 divided by 3, bora na lang tayo para hindi magulo. Bakit pareho kaya yung uh, multiplication sa division? Ibig sabihin ng 2 divided by negative 3. 12 divided by negative 3. Diba? Ang, ang, ang division is really multiplication of the reciprocal, diba? So, actually, multiplication din ito. This, is, this can be converted to 12 times negative 1 third, diba? When you divide a number by a certain number, you are actually multiplying the reciprocal. So, ibig sabihin, pareho lang ito kasi Lahat naman ng division division operation, pwede mong i-convert sa multiplication. So, multiplication and division, aga apply itong rule na to. So, this is 12 divided by negative 3, magkaiba sila ng sign. So, negative 4. Okay? 20 divided by oh, negative 20 divided by negative 4, same sign. Positive. Positive 5. Okay? Same sign, positive. Different signs, negative. Okay? So, paano pala pag marami? Ano? Yung pinakalast example natin sa multiplication. Halimbawa, last example. Negative 3 times negative 4 times 3 times negative 2 times negative 1. Okay? Pag ganito yung example ilan. Ito magiging positive to, di ba? This becomes positive. Kasi negative and negative, positive. And this this becomes also positive. So positive times positive times positive equals positive yung magiging sagot. Okay? 12 times 3, 36 times 2, 72. Tama ba? 12, 36, 72. So sagot is positive, 72. Okay, kahit isa-isahin nyo yan, ay talagang magiging positive yan kasi, kumari ito, negative 3 times negative 4, 12, times 3, 36, and then from here, 36 times negative 2, negative 72, tama? And then, negative 72 times negative 1, sorry, times negative 1 equals 72. So, pareho lang, kahit anong way, kahit anong order, magiging positive siya. So, 3 times 4, 12 times 3, 36 times 2, 72. Okay, so maraming salamat and I hope naintindihan nyo itong lesson na ito.